Let's talk a little bit about tonight. It's just a great win at Madison Square Garden. How did that feel for you? It was great to just get that first win at Madison Square Garden. You know, after being gone for three years, um, we showed a great team effort tonight. Everyone that went in the game contributed and, and just played hard, and we came out with a victory. Talk about what you were able to do and some of the keys for your success tonight. Well, I just knew coming in that, you know, there were going to be very many shots for me tonight. So I just tried to make sure that I played great defense and, and took charges and got rebounds and just helped out the team any way possible. I, I, let me ask you this. What do you think is better for the team Cause in terms of you? Cause when you start or when you come in and clean up and come through? Because I see there's a difference, I mean, in that. And the, the second half, you really... Uh, you know, put it out there. Um, I don't. I don't think there's a difference uh, for this team for me uh, as far as me starting or me coming off the bench. It's just about how hard I play and how aggressive I play, whether it's from the beginning or whether it's from coming off the bench. Uh, I just need to maintain that focus and to know that you know, great defense is what's gonna what this team needs. You of all people know um, Lambda is us and some style because you came from Detroit. Has it changed or are people finally beginning to willing to accept? what he has uh, used as his style for winning. I think everyone on this team is just finally buying in and understanding the concept and the style that he's trying to employ us to, to use. And you can really tell out there on the floor that we're really coming together and we're really understanding each other as well as the system. Right. Take care, thanks. How do you feel the team has been progressing? You know, do you feel like you guys are finally are starting to come together? And I definitely think we're finally starting to come together. You know, we took a couple um, losses early on, you know, after winning Connecticut. And I think that we really learned from those losses. You know, we lost to Minnesota by five, who was a returning championship from a championship. So, you know, that's just showing us that, you know, if we just go out there every night and we fight and we play together and we play with each other, anything can happen. And that's what happened tonight. I was about to ask you, I know it was a loss, but that does help, I guess, the confidence a little bit that you were in there against the defending champions and, and that you were battling against them. It definitely helps to, to build our confidence to know that we only lost to Minnesota by five. You know, even though they're a depleted team, they still had great players like Maya Moore and Simone Augustus and Lindsey Whalen who know what it takes to win those championships. So for us to even be close in the game and not really have that team chemistry and the understanding of Coach Lambeer's system is, is a great nod to us and just, just let us know how hard we're going to have to play and how we're going to have to depend on each other. Now talk about, I guess, what you and the team will be doing next to bring this momentum onto the road with you. Um, we're just going to go out. You know, we've got a back-to-back -back coming up uh, against Washington and Indiana, who are both great teams. Um, we know that there's no easy team. There's no night off. And we can't just celebrate this win for the rest of the week. We're going to go to practice tomorrow, and we're going to go practice hard, and we're going to be mentally focused for the next game, and, and we're hopefully going to come out with another victory. On a different note, tonight was the Hoops for the Troops event. Um, can you maybe just reflect a little bit on that and what it meant, I guess, not only for you, but what you would think it would mean for the team to have been able to do this and honor the Troops a little bit? Um, tonight was very special, you know, to be able to honor the Troops, you know, who have fought for our freedoms and, uh, you know, those who have given their lives for the freedoms that I have, you know, to be able to hear, be here and celebrate and also get a victory in their honor is, is a blessing, you know. Um, just want to thank them for our, their service and everything that they do. And you know what? They'll never be forgotten, those ones that, that have lost their lives fighting for our freedom. Thank you very much. Thank you.